Well, it was June 2019 when we first imagined this day. In the meantime, there's been an assignment to Italy, pandemic, and here we are, standing at the doorway to 2022 and preparing to celebrate the Christmas season for you and your families, and yet here we stand on this beautiful day in December. Jimmy, I have prayed for you way before I knew your name. And boy, did God deliver the best soulmate I could have ever asked for. Not only did God provide a soulmate, he provided a home. Typically, a home is a place, but for me, it's a person, and that's you. Sarah. You came into my life right at exactly the right time, when I wasn't ready, and yet when I needed your love the most. We've been through circumstances that have pushed the boundaries of what we thought we could endure, and in the end, it's only solidified and strengthened the connection we share together. No matter where we are in the world, wherever we land, you have always felt like home. So from here on out, I vow to put God and us, our home, first, and make sure that we are constantly building, working, and growing together. I vow to love you and honor our commitment when we are near and far from each other. I promise to love you in every season, football season, <laughs> go Buckeyes, <laughs> baseball season, go Rays or Braves, soccer season, go Chelsea, hockey season, go Lightning, marathon season, go Jimmy, etc. <laughs> I love your passions goals and dreams, and I vow to always support them. No ceremony, no ceremony can create your marriage. Only you can do that. Through love and patience, through dedication and perseverance, through talking and listening, helping, supporting and believing in each other, through tenderness and, and laughter, through learning to forgive, learning to appreciate your differences and by learning to make the important things matter and to let go of all the rest. I vow to always put you first even during Ohio State's football season <laughs> and Chelsea's soccer season in the Rays and Braves baseball season. <laughs> I vow to take your hand when it's too dark and take the dog out when it's too early. <laughs> you know me better than anyone else in this world and somehow you still manage to love me. And you help me to be the finest version of myself that I can. I love you forever and always. So now in the name of God, I declare you to be husband and wife. From this day forward, your family, friends, community, and indeed the whole world will know that you are co-travelers through life, soulmates, and adventurers as the adventure continues. James? You may kiss your bride.
to be able to show me what true love actually is and finding a soulmate, that is just beyond anything I could ever think of. And I'm incredibly blessed to be able to have both of you, to be able to like have me on all your adventures that you've had. Sarah, you've been a blessing to not just Jimmy, but to my family as well. And I know that I say this on behalf of all of us. We love you, and we are so incredibly happy to be able to call you a Carlton. Are you ready or not? Ready or not? Are you ready or not? The best is yet to go. Are you ready or not? Ready or not? Are you ready or not? They grew their love for each other in one of the most hardest times. And if that's not a testament of true love, I don't know what is. And now we're here to celebrate, and it's my time to give my adventure buddy over to Jimmy. I love you guys. And with that, a toast to the bride and groom. The best is yet to go. Go!